Terry, according to Sheriff Morgan, the guys were passing through post heading from Seattle to Houston, but their stories weren't adding up, and that's when they called in a canine who found drugs in the vehicle along with the weapons. Uh, when the guys were searching the car, they found uh, marijuana, they found some pills, they found uh, THC, enough to where the THC was a felony amount. Sheriff Morgan says Caleb Cole and Bruce Umba were driving a blue Ford Focus when they were pulled over in post for going 42 in a 35. But at that time, Morgan says they weren't aware of their affiliation with the neo-Nazi group, the Adam Waffen. They're strictly a terrorist group, a white supremacy group. Umba claimed that the drugs, rifles, and ammo were all his, so Cole was let go. We had no idea. We didn't know anything about Adam Waffen group. and. and there was no reason to arrest him. Neither one of them have any criminal history of any kind. No tattoos, no markings. I mean, just clean cut uh, guys. Besides their stories not lining up, Morgan says their demeanor seemed pretty normal. No uh, disrespect, no resistance. Uh, just very cooperative guys, very knowledgeable in federal gun laws. Umba was arrested and detained in Garza County, but was later transported here to the Lubbock County Detention Center. He was indicted on Wednesday and in court today pleaded not guilty. But if convicted, Umba faces up to 10 years in federal prison. Sheriff Morgan says he is proud of his guys because if it weren't for this arrest, there's no telling what these two men were planning. They, they make a lot of good drug busts and make a lot of great arrests, but I mean, this was just kind of a, a step above something that we had never dealt with before.